Hey guys, it's Val. Today we're going to be playing a demo. It's called Follow. Now you may be thinking that sounds really familiar to a demo that you've already played. Well, it is by the same developers. It's supposed to be along the same lines, like with the doubt and the self-doubt and the bullying and things like that. I was really impressed by the demo that I played in November by these guys, so I have no doubt that this one is going to be just as cool. So yeah, let's go. Okay. What am I doing here? Why is my house so... strange? It's like... the memory of a dream. I need to figure out what's going on. Am I in danger? What makes you think that we're in danger? Okay. Got some drawings on the wall. This place looks like beat up, but I mean, it's decorated, you know? Are you gonna... There's no power, okay. Let's just look around here. There's nothing, looks like nothing in here to mess with. Hmm. Okay. Dear Santa Claus, this year mom told me that I can ask for presents only if I get good grades at school. She loves me so much. I've been a good girl and I really like the red dress I saw in the beautiful store near our house. Can I have that? Thank you, Anne. I was eight when I wrote this letter. How is it here? Mom should have thrown it away a long time ago. What does it mean I don't understand? Okay, so maybe we're having a flashback to something that traumatized us as a kid. Won't let me go in there yet. Let's go this way. No? No? Some. Can I only go in this room? Is that supposed to happen? Let's, can we watch the TV? No. Well, let me go in there. Oh, I can look at the painting. And then you've got this painting. Which looks really cool, actually. So won't let me go in that door. Or that door. Can I play the piano? Nope. A book. This book. I can't believe it. Mythology. Camilla was crazy about history and mythology in elementary school. She never stopped talking about it. She lent it to me, and after we argued... I never gave it back. It makes my blood boil just thinking about it. Hmm. Why are you? Are you the pink I got to cook for Christmas this year? <laughs> <laughs> it's not true. Come on, Bat, you're wrong. Oh God, my classmates were so mean. Thinking back makes my stomach churn. I absolutely wanted to look like her. I adored her. It feels like I'm a child again. All of this makes no sense. But maybe I'm just dreaming and I'll wake up soon? Okay. Oh, it's red in here. Huh. Maybe I can go through a door now. Not that door. 
Oh, but the, the couch moved. Okay, we just don't have lights. <sighs> Ghost chair. Red. A color that in Western culture is a powerful symbol of aggression, power, and danger. This intense and vibrant color can be overwhelming, blinding, and threatening. Yes. Red means danger. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. And welcome to a new episode of History with Anne. Today, we'll read a page in the Great Book of Humanity, understanding how history has been written over time, shaping reality. <laughs> in this episode, we'll seek answers in Norse mythology. According to these ancient beliefs, the earthly reality we're experiencing she looks like is a just one of the gnome. many realms <laughs> in the cosmos. Connecting it to the realm of gods is the rainbow bridge Bifrost, thrown between the sky and the earth. This solid strip of seven colors connects humans to another reality and its wisdom. When at the end of the world, the rainbow bridge broke, humans lost this knowledge. In our era, perhaps we no longer believe in these old myths, but we can still ask ourselves, are we truly connected to reality and its knowledge? <laughs> that is I don't by understand. far the weirdest encounter in a game How I have ever had. Did end up here? Ever. Ooh. Some spider webs. An old and mysterious key. Hmm. No lights. It's just dark. Okay. Did it say Anne and Camilla? Little doll. I love you so much! Mom, do you like the doll I made at school? Oh, magnificent. Teachers always know how to make you waste precious time. They don't understand how important your future is. It's called I arts and crafts, I was girl. So blind. But I was just a child. How could I realize what a monster my mother is? Huh. There's something inside this doll. I need to find a way to open it. It doesn't look like... It's very strong, like we could rip that open. Anne and Camilla, yep. Oh no, we want that on. That's about... The only source of light that we have. <laughs> oh, I'm back in here. Was there anything else around this corner? Let's... Okay, no, it wasn't. Okay. We need a knife, maybe? No, but this is... Was this there before? A disturbing drawing of a pig. I mean, it's... I know it, it was used to bully her probably, but it's actually pretty pretty good. <laughs> Maybe we're looping. Maybe we go back to the hallway. Oh. I'm gonna go this way. Need a key for that. Hmm. Oh, my door. 
My door is gone. What the fuck? Nothing in there. Don't jump out at me. I will knock the shit out of you. Don't do it, bitch. Okay. You want me to wander? Okay. Mm -mm. God dang it. It's going to jump at me when I... Don't do it. I don't know why I felt like it was going to make me go back. Scissors. Oh, that'll that'll cut the doll, right? So stab a bitch with them too. Okay. Oh, red therefore is not just a color, it's a journey, a path of growth and discovery. It's a symbol, a message, a guide. It's a challenge, but also a promise. It's the color of danger, but also of salvation. It's the color of aggression, but also of love. Ultimately, it's the color of life itself. Yeah. I'm still going to stick with red as danger. Hmm. I can't remember. Do I go downstairs for the little doll? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here you go. That looks so fucked up. Okay, what's in there? Chocolate bar? No. Is that a lighter? Yeah. You're not gonna give it to me? You're not gonna give me any kind of light source? That's fine. You want us to be in the dark? It's time. It's the dress I wrote about my letter to Santa Claus. In the end, I've been good and my parents have bought it for me. I thought I looked fabulous when I put it on. Too bad my classmates teased me to death. It's ruined, I remember. I was so upset that I tore it apart. Hmm. 
The fuck was that? I'm just looking. You know, you never know. <laughs> Change. <laughs> like that. That's very different. Hello. Do you want to eat something? With the light off? With the light on? You're pretty cool, but how do I move you? Burn it? The tree? No way. No, she did not. No fucking way. She did not burn her Christmas tree as a kid. 